What is up guys, it's me Vlad and today we're going to discuss the new game mode inside of Gorilla Tag. And I find this actually sick because as you guys may know, the new hockey cosmetics were added to Gorilla Tag recently. So if we go to a city, we can find a bunch of new cosmetics uh, related to hockey. As you guys can see, I got some of them. Uh, by the way, I got them for completely free. If you actually want to learn how to do this glitch, uh, let me know in the comments guys. And also make sure to subscribe to not miss the video where I will showcase how to do the free cosmetics glitch which allows you to pretty much get any cosmetic uh, for completely free as you guys can see uh, uh, what was, bro oh my god bro what was that yo, bro did I just hear Lucy man what <laughs> yo, okay man I, I think I'm tripping man I think I'm tripping guys uh, but yeah as you guys may know we got the hockey cosmetics and as you guys may also know by the previous updates cosmetics don't come without a reason and we could have seen that with the Halloween update, for example. Uh, we got Lucy added, we got a bunch of new stuff uh, added within it, uh, you know, within the update. But we got the, um, what it seems like, hockey cosmetics, which actually don't have any use at all. As you guys can see, we have the Winter Sale, uh, which they aren't really part of, because the Winter Sale is this part. But this isn't really a winter themed, I feel like, because hockey is like all year round sport. So, this got me thinking if it's an all year round sport, we might get a game mode. And, and I actually found out something interesting today. As you guys uh, obviously may know, we have this tunnel, which is reserved for dungeon map slash horror map. Uh, and uh, this seems like by these uh, two. Uh, torches but what you guys forgot is the secret tunnel we still have the secret tunnel which has been in the works for a while uh, and uh, as you guys may know the secret tunnel actually has a lot of stuff in it uh, or you probably don't know about this but uh, it actually has its own uh, let me just showcase it to you guys. Uh, so, pretty much, if we go into a secret tunnel, for example, I use a mod menu. Uh, and uh, if we go inside of the tunnel, if we no clip through it. By the way, guys, if you want to install any mod, a mod menu or something like that, I've got a bunch of tutorials. Also, make sure to join my Discord. It's the first link down below in the description. And I have descriptions for installations of any mod uh, if you guys ever wanted that. Uh, but if we no clip through the wall, oh my god, no. We can see that the, there is an actual entrance here. So let me get platforms. I actually forgot them. That's why I fell down. Uh, but as you guys can see, there's an actual entrance which goes to this side of the map. And it ends over here abruptly. This got me thinking. Since there is an actual ice mechanic added inside of the game, I feel like they were just testing it. Uh, because, I mean, it wouldn't really make sense to just add an ice mechanic without any reason. This got me thinking. What if they were just testing this for the hockey game mode? And it, and this actually makes sense. Because, as you guys may know, um, the secret wall slash uh, secret tunnel was here for a while already. But, but there was nothing happening with it. And my theory is that Lemming was trying to develop a sports game mode slash hockey game mode for a while. But he couldn't because he is a single developer, obviously, and it's pretty hard to actually make new mechanics and stuff like that while he was also making different updates, stuff like that. So, nowadays, we have 17 developers actually working on Gorilla Tag. And this means that uh, they have more freedom. For example, so one team can actually work on the horror game mode. One team can work on this tunnel, which hasn't been removed still. Uh, if there was nothing to plan here, in my opinion, it would just get removed. And uh, I feel like previously uh, there weren't that many girl attack players, really. Because I remember a few months ago, we had like... 12,000 or 8,000 players. Actually, it wasn't like a few months ago. It was like five months ago. So, Gorilla Attack kind of like fell off 
quite a bit, but it regained its momentum uh, and it became so much better nowadays. So, so, uh, since that, since that, he, Lemming couldn't really make another map or few maps because people wouldn't really play them. But since we have like stable 50,000 players playing the game currently, uh, I mean, we have enough players for pretty much any map to be filled fully. Uh, so this is just my theory. Let me know your thoughts about this in the comments. Does this make sense or not? Uh, and uh, pretty much, yeah. Uh, by the way, guys, by the way, uh, make sure to subscribe if you're new. We're on our road to 30k and only you can help me reach that goal. Also, also, if you uh, ever want to buy some uh, quest games, make sure to join my Discord. It's the first link down below in the description, as you guys may see. We have a bunch of different game sales slash coupons. And even if you don't need to buy games right now, for example, in the future, once a new game comes out, uh, it's uh, quest referral slash coupon appears here immediately. And because um, Oculus allows the referrals pretty much on day one of games being released. I did this with Bone Lab, so I got 25% of Bone Lab on the first day of it being released, and I bought it for $30 instead of $40, which is $10 dif difference, slash 25% off, which is a pretty substantial amount for a lot of people. Uh, but uh, there are games like Blade and Sorcery, Bone Lab, Chapter 1, Chapter 2 of Saints and Sinners. There are so many games. You can just scroll through them infinitely, uh, and uh, you can use any of these links infinitely. It doesn't matter. So in the future, you might need this. By the way, there's the PC VR version of Gorilla Attack with 25% off. So if you ever want to buy Gorilla Attack on PC, you can do it for 15 bucks instead of a usual 20 which they'll charge you in both Oculus slash Steam. Uh, as you guys can see, um, they charge you $20 now, um, but uh, you pretty much get a sale on also shiny rocks because you get uh, 5,000 shiny rocks with this, the equivalent amount of t 20 bucks plus uh, I think there's like 1,000 shiny rocks on top of that, uh, so you know. Uh, you get a lot, so make sure to join the Discord, even if you don't chat, man, you know, you may need uh, to just hop in and get some sales in the future, or you can just um, get them while uh, you need to, you know, it's not like a requirement, it'll be here, you know, uh, in a year or two, you know, uh, so I'm not removing that, uh, so, uh, yeah, uh, I kind of got my thought... <sighs> Um, or train of thought off of that. So yeah. Um, by the way, guys. By the way, uh, make sure to subscribe for you. You know, I said this previously, but I upload growth tag videos daily. I try to keep you guys updated on the latest growth tag news uh, and um, you know uh, some interesting theories uh, and stuff like that. Also, I have uh, the video of Gorilla Tag uh, Quest mods with multiplayer planned soon. So. You know, make sure to subscribe to us, miss that. And also, uh, the video about the, the uh, free cosmetics glitch. There are a bunch of stuff planned for the future. So make sure to subscribe to not miss that. But yeah, it was me, Vlad. Thank you for watching the video. Have a great rest of your day, guys. Make sure to follow your dreams. And, uh, you know, if you have stuff to do, make sure to do it right now. Don't plan to do it in the future, you know. Uh, if you have some homework, man, do it right now, man. Because uh, it won't do it by itself, you know. Uh, and you don't want to miss your homework, man. <laughs> you know, gotta get good grades. Uh, and, uh, yeah. If you're just chilling, uh, have a good night, man. Uh, but, yeah. See you later, guys. Bye-bye. I'm out. May God bless you. Pew. Make sure to subscribe. You know, there is a button over here. And if you're interested, you can watch one of these videos uh, over here on the screen. Bye-bye. Yeah,